Hello everybody, welcome into another Final Fantasy XIII stream, the last one in fact. Um, we are going to just be doing some post-game cleanup here. Um, maybe going for the super bosses, uh, we'll see how far we get. Uh, you know, just killing some stuff, doing some missions. So let's get on with it. Uh, I've already uh, done some, uh, some grinding because, uh, well, it takes a while, so... Um, we have a lot more HP now and uh, other stats of course as well. Um, so we should be able to deal with a lot of these um, missions. Um, for example, we have now more than 10,000 HP so we can survive the Jumbo Cactuar up there. Um, but we need to actually pick up the missions. I mean, we can still get stronger so might as well keep killing things. Let's see how quick we can kill this Cactuar here. Okay, Vanille's, uh, Vanille should not be saboteuring right now. They do have an elemental weakness, so yeah, let's give them those Ravagers. So they can drop some fire on this one. Oh, and lightning was and fired as well, so that's nice. So among other things, I uh, I was able to secure... I think we have an extra trapezohedron, I think. But enough to upgrade uh, this team's weapons, at least. Um, well, what was the reason for this? Can you jump over that? I don't remember. Um, wasn't there a chocobo right here? No. Oh yeah, I was gonna go to the... to the mission stones here. Uh, wait a second. Oh, I, I thought two of these were lying down, but no. They were just behind that. Um, so we've done uh, these two. Should keep going on with these. Hambaba in the Mahabra Earthworks. Uh, we do need to also go to go to Mahabra for the for the stuff. It's just Titan tightening around. Roar. Mission commenced. Um. I mean, I would like to get a chocobo for that. I guess the closest chocobo is right there. We'll go pick that up so we can get to Mahabra a little bit faster. I don't know if there's seem any particular order we need to be doing this in. Well, there are there are a few that you know unlock each other, but. Um, otherwise, as long as we just do all of them, should be fine. <laughs> Chocobo time! Oof. <laughs> this, like, 
weird foggy dust stormy thing is not the most fun. I'm not sure if this is the, like, side we need to be going through, but... Or if we should rather teleport inside, but might as well just go here. Um, we'll get some CP along the way if we need to fight. So everybody's got their, um, like, main... Main um, paradigm, uh, main crystariums are uh, maxed out. Uh, the like primary one and then the secondary ones. Um, I think Lightning's the only one who doesn't have the both secondaries maxed out. And um, yeah, then we're just gonna work on the tertiary um, crystariums after that. Or them stats. And I guess for Lightning as well. I suppose for lightning, um, getting sentinel up is gonna be handy because then we'll, we'll have a sentinel to use um, as our as our dodge tank. The more of the abyss. Where are we going? Oh, it's it's all right, right here. And wait a minute, has this activated? Oh yes, that's active. Okay, so we can do that one as well. Hopefully, it's here in Mahabra as well. Let's uh, start off by beating up this Hombaba. These should be pretty quick to deal with. Yep. Uh, and they are also kind of hard to dodge here, so might as well just plow through them. Yeah, it's the thunder that's really, really crushing them. So I'm not sure what exactly determines, but de determines it. But I think that the like um, part time for enemies goes down. So I'm not sure if that's based on your um, Crystarium level or or what. But um, it certainly wasn't 24 seconds for that kind of a an encounter the first time around. I always thought it was just like based on the actual, um, just based purely on on the uh, enemies, but apparently not. Protect. Where's my Thunder? Hope. 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 There we go. I was thinking we could just beat through these half lights with Thunder, so. We don't have to worry about anything else. Nah, it's just gonna bring in an endless amount of them. Oh, look. do these give me... Do I get CP out of these half lights? Because then this could... be an alright idea. But now the balance is dead. I wonder if they do give you CP because... It's just gonna keep... creating more of them. No rating. Alright. Are you two together? Yes. Interesting. Um. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I used up all the deceptive tools. I forgot. Uh, we could buy more, but yeah. Um. Okay, I think we'll just go in here. I don't care to play around with trying to get any sort of back attacks. 
Um, let's break this pulse sword sentry in real fast so we don't need to worry about it. The Baba is nicely enough you know, waiting in line. Time for another approach. Back to bullying. Like, this is ostensibly the tougher version of a uh, regular behemoth, but... Yeah, I feel like the king behemoth is worse <laughs> than this thing. Oh, now it's gonna transform. Oh yeah, I forgot that it dispels itself as well. Could've kept Vanilla's uh, Savager. Oh well, it's dead anyway. Be ready for the next fight. Easy peasy. Mission complete. Speed sash. Okay, let's go and uh, let's go check out this seed stone in here to see what we can find. Because this one has never been active before. And then there's one that's uh, deep in the in the trenches where we'll also have to go at some point. That boss fight should be doable now as well since um, it was oh whoops it was pretty close already before where um, it wasn't able to one-shot us anymore. That's one way of dealing with it. Good job, Lightning. Alright, who this? Hello? Faltering Faith, Juggernaut, Tajin's Tower. No, <laughs> I don't want to go there. The cloven spire of Tajin's Tower forms the bridge between the Arclight Steppe and the outlying lands. The rampaging Juggernaut now bars all passage and I have been charged with its disposal. Why do the Falsi value that place so? Why do they protect it and yet stand idly by when our village is threatened? I sense the place must guard some secret of theirs. Alright, so we're going to have to go to Tajin's Tower then. Um, I suppose um, this is going to be the target. I mean, outside could also work. Nah, you know what, let's go. Let's go forward. Make our way in there and... Clear the place out. Whoa! I got seen. That's how it's done. <laughs> That's how it's done. <laughs> Do it. Like this is actually a decent, decent place um, for some CP farming um, because you can beat these enemies so quickly. Um, that you can just like keep going from encounter to encounter and just racking up a ton of a ton of CP even though they might not give a lot um, like per fight but, you know with the growth egg and and just you know speed I think it's even faster if you just go in with like triple ravager and just thunder everything Right now, I'm wasting a little bit of time by buffing and debuffing. Thanks. Michelle and in peril. There's the thunder. I don't know why Hope decides to use. Uh, 
use protect first in this matchup. But against half lights only. Just another battle. Um, it's and fire and thunder. I mean, it's because of the box balance, of course, but like, why? I'm not sure. Oh, these things move around quite a bit. Oh yeah, and everyone's now got the full six ATB uh, segments, so. Now triple blizz is possible. As well as a lot of other like triple techs, triple cura, triple all of that. Oh no, then we have these plans. I guess they're, they're going to be quite easy as well right now. I mean, actually, I think Cerberus is probably a great way to go because they are... No, wait, because they are resistant to... <laughs> no, 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 no. Relentless Sword, because they are resistant to magic, specifically, but weak against life and so... No problem. But yeah, I think um, the Nils weapon still needs. Yeah, Nirvana still needs uh, 19 levels. Otherwise, the main uh, weapons are fully upgraded. So teleport to Tejin's Tower. Oh yeah, this is also the area with the lags. So <laughs> let's hope we don't get the lags. It's gonna be in the land of lags or... Uh, it's just before the, before it, luckily. Avoid the dogs. Yep. Oh, pff. got me. I saw the juggernaut though. Be ready for the next fight. Here we go. So at this point I'm slightly um, questioning the usefulness of the um, sprint shoes. Because can I not back attack you? Ah, whatever. Uh, because um, we could just cast the spell. And we could instead have something else in that uh, spot in the, in the accessories. Thank you. We'll see. Right, let's go down to assault and let's break it down. At this point, at least for a lot of the, um, a lot of the easier enemies, we no longer really need a tank, we no longer really need a healer, because we can just survive it without them. Some army of one combos here. Yeah. 
steam cleaning again. Come on, break it. Getting staggered for some reason. Well, it's dead. So that's fine. No stars, although, come on. Uh, you ran a night, okay? Cool, 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 cool. Um, there is no stones around here to activate um i wonder if we should go back to Sluia springs if there were any seed stones there i don't remember might as well go check it out because it's right right here um, yeah, we can just pop in and then hop back out. There's nothing. Let's see. Let us see. Oh, there is, there is, yeah. There is one. And that's the only one. But, uh, let's go to it. So we have the only one done. Um... Yeah, we'll, we'll uh, activate it and see where it leads us. Hopefully it's uh, right in here. And yeah, like I said um, yesterday, I decided that I'm uh, that we're gonna big break up the 13 series after all, and that um, we're gonna be playing Final Fantasy VII um, next. But then after seven, we'll go back to 13 too, or maybe like during seven as well. Who knows? But uh, we'll, we'll like we'll, we won't do them back to back to back exactly. But we will be doing 13 too later though Adam and Tortoise crushed by doubt well then <laughs> I guess we're going to fight an Adam and Tortoise I've been given the focus of eliminating and stampeding Adam and Tortoise in the eastern tours of the Arclight Steppe it seems someone enraged the beast by attacking its young <laughs> me and the foul sea wish dead I understand the danger it poses but is violence the only solution I would be enraged if someone attacked my child it just seems so wrong. Alright, well, we're going up against an Adamant Toys. I think the Adamant Tor Toys is the weaker version of it. Um, we can see if we can take it out, uh, like... Um, how should I put it? Like... Fair and square? <laughs> or uh, if we if we need to go to death, a death route. Let's go to the teleport over here. And we're gonna find out. I mean, I think I'll still open up by getting the summon involved. Teleport to. Ah, uh, Central Expanse is probably good as any.
so this is mission 63, which is then um, amongst the last ones. I don't remember how many there are, but not too many more than 63. 65 or something like that. Uh, then we're gonna go and beat up uh, Titan's thing. Uh, we're gonna finish off the circle over here. There's also the circle in um, the massive um, that we need to take care of if it's active already. Um, I actually haven't seen it active yet, so I don't remember what exactly um, opens it up. But I think it opens up one of the super bosses, if I recall correctly. Let's just dig them. Still got to do a few digs for the uh, for the final final choco treasure. Hmm. Some more Millerite. So much Millerite. Oops. Don't hop up there. Wrong side, maybe? Please don't bully me. Some treasure over here as well. Upstairs, I think that's the element or toys that I need to be worrying about. Not in here, though. It's further this way. There was one, like, right around here. Yep. Hmm. Is this it? What's this? Ribbon! It is, it is. The final Choco Treasure. We don't really need a ribbon, though. Um, Alright, let's see if we can just beat this up. As is. Right now, technique. Summon... Odin. Yodin. Yeah. So I'm purposefully skipping um, Odin. Because um, that just... That just uses up some of the time the we have. For, with the element tortoise down. I think we'll be better spent by um, attacking with the whole party. Until next time. Get those sins, get those sabs. It is with all we got. Thanks. I've already lost haste. Why is Vanilla losing haste? That was weird. Oh, I think the Vanilla actually can't do anything else right now, so let's just break it. Take that. 
Really good. The big ones. Boop. It's getting up. It's getting up. Mm. I should probably go for the legs. Heal, heal. Okay, heal faster. Heal faster, please. Okay, we're good, we're good. Make sure we have the best defense here. And then let's uh, go for the legs. Sweep the legs. Heels New strategy. and sweep the leg. Oh, yeah, I think actually uh, this is not going to be a good combo now. Oh, let me go uh, recuperate. Actually, no, wait, not not that salvation, salvation. Whoops, wrong one, wrong one, <laughs> wrong one, wrong one. Right. Now, why are you attacking that leg? Attack the one that's weaker. No, quick. No. No. I feel like we can do this. <laughs> Let's try again. Hmm, I don't have any any uh, aerosols though. I'll probably manage without them as well. Thank you. Shaman. Skip. Uh, guest hunt mode. We do this Skip. Do the Zantsuki. Skip. Cerulean. Hello, Cerulean. Welcome in. How are you doing? Until next time. Hit it with that stuff. Then Thanks. Get some uh, buffs in here. Actually, I think we should probably just go for relentless assault, to be honest. And for go the buffs, because a lot of a lot of the buffs are just gonna be defensive ones. Um, so I'll just raise it up to the breaking point here, then we're gonna go for this, for the, uh, assassination Cerberus statue. Deal with this. And getting a few more debuffs in there like that. And get that stagger gauge maxed out. Poor MD is here, so hello, hello. Hope you're doing well. Are we maxing out on stagger now? I mean, the whole stagger game is gonna go off now, but. I'll do one more army of one, and uh, we'll have to do a relentless assault on this actually, so that they. Focus fire. Out of my way. Oh, everyone's dead. Uh, renew, please. Whoops. And buff, please. Steady now. Okay, quick heals. Heels and buff again. Thanks. Do 
do all the buffs, please. All the buffs. I wonder if lightning would be any good in a triple synergist combo. We are fully buffed. Oh, quaking. We're gonna keep, keep full health, yeah? So, let's go and hit the leg. Sweep the leg. Damage. We'll need some rebuffs here. Plus protect. Thanks. Get about the leg for a moment here. Keep a cool head. Gonna heal up quick and then hit the leg. We're playing a lot of protection here, so it's hard to get get the leg down. Keep those buffs up. New strategy. Sweep the leg again. I'm gonna try to go in in with. Uh, Army of one this time. Quake. Oh no. Oh, the Neil's dead. No. This is not going according to plan. Please heal Vanilla up real fast. New strategy. And I guess we are going in with the buffs again. Rebuffs. Right when I thought we could sweep the leg. Yep, protects are dropping off, so I need to get those back up. There we go. And back on the leg. No. Was low enough health <laughs> that lightning died. Hmm. I'm feeling like we can't brute force this yet. I wonder if we should just do a maybe we'll just we'll just do a death roll on this. Um So yeah, I think we'll just go in with a sab 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 and just, you know, do the old uh, death strat. <laughs> Summon. Summon stuff. And then... See you next time. 
death. It's gonna work. One of these days, it's gotta work. I guess Lightning has a few um, Saboteur spells. I don't remember that. But I suppose so. Here we go. Didn't even take long. GG easy. Mission complete. Genji Glove! Genji. Uh, so the Genji Gloves are interesting. They give you... Um, they let you break damage limits um, in the game. Uh, switch battle shield back. And let's make this bully again. There we go. Easy enough. Did we do this one? Yeah. That one's done. Um, I guess let's go pick up the next one from the circle. I'm also a little bit worried going on this side because those... Those dogs can, you know, catch you pretty easy. And then that'll bring me to a fight with the Adamant Toys as well. Don't! Don't! Do not! No! No! Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, we don't have the TP for, for a summon either, so... Yeah. <laughs> Shall we try this again? <laughs> Yeah. And so it ends. It's better to go. I, I feel like it's better to go um, in. Like it's all right to go inside from this side, but out is easier from the other side where there's no dogs. Let me give it another try, though. All I gotta do is dodge the dogs. Just let me be, thank you. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Every night, I can feel my leg. Indeed. I can feel my leg right now. And the other one. Uh, a Zernitra in Sulia Springs. Well, we just came from there. I guess we're going back. Yeah, yeah, Titan, I know. Roar, you are angry. Let's go for the Chocobo. Leg. Chocobo, get over here. I want a Chocobo whistle so I can just call upon them. Whenever I need. Hello, Choco. So we'll just go to the teleporter and uh, hop on to Sulia Springs then, I suppose. Oh yeah, there was one thing I noticed. Um, I don't think I ever opened the menu on, on the Chocobo. <laughs> I think it's funny they give you the Chocobo as a, as a character which, with question mark HP. Teleport to Slayer Springs. Slayer 
See ya. So where? In the middle, of course. Hello! I have come to kill you. And your friends. And your dog, too. Horship dance? No, you don't. Oh, you already did. Okay, I feel like some of this stuff is really working out. Do my allies, like, be any more useful and hope decided to die classic hope in classic hope hope fashion so give me some uh, buffs real fast and then some pastes up and uh, then we're gonna hit them with some big damage Okay, they're just gonna be getting rid of my haste, it seems. Okay, one more big heal on hope, please, and then let's go. Let's <laughs> let's destroy these Ceratoraptors real fast. They are clearly causing some issues. Hold on now. Assuming direct control, just use blitz. Just blitz them all. We should probably heal up before before that happens. Okay, I need to kill those Ceratoraptors a little bit faster. I was not expecting them to be any sort of threat. Let's go through them one by one. They are quick to stagger and quick to kill uh, when you just focus them down. Break it, break it. Oop, I got taken out. Let's medic up. Get some Asunas in the house. I'm back to killing. Lightning got taken out. I, I saw that that the health was not at max, and I saw the feeding suit, but I was hoping that it would not come down to this. I'm gonna go in from behind. Thanks. They're all slowed down. That is not fun. That deserves salt if we help. And a waste of it. And lightning set again. These debuffs, no. I tell you.
I think we waste a little bit too much time on the switch here, so... Let me just set it up from the very beginning. Also lose their um, stagger gauge pretty fast. That feeding stoop on lightning. No. Hmm. I wonder how it will work if we go for the for the boss first. And in fact ignore the raptors. Probably not the best choice, but let's see what happens. I'm not going to die from this. So I don't know if I really uh, achieve much with that. Yeah, like staggering it is not a problem. We definitely need to worry about the frogs. Maybe I can get some buffs in here. Thanks. It'll be okay. I don't think so. We're getting debuffed so hard. Just gonna just gonna take care of these raptors. Really. Feeding stoop on cope. As long as that doesn't get hit on lightning, I guess. That's the main thing. And lightning having deep protect. It's not a good look. I was not expecting this fight to be actually this hard. Um, it's on on the surface, it's not anything too special. But um, apparently, just the like amount of debuffing that's going on here is is the main issue. Ribbon actually wouldn't be too hot, too, too bad in this one. Guess we just gotta try and get these raptors down. Oh, my allies are both down. Dazed away. Keep 
gebracht hat. I actually don't have a sentinel paradigm right now. Probably should have something. I feel like it probably should be one that is more more um, offensive oriented though. Not just like a pure pure shutdown. So we can keep dealing with the enemies while also uh, being protected. These these uh, days are lasting a long time. Here. Okay, one more raptor. And then the summon. Nope, it's not here anymore. Wait, is it? Yeah, yeah. It's right there. The Ceratosaur. Alright, now... Now we're talking. Now it's 1v1. Raise up. Buff up. Keep it together. It'll be okay. Thank you. Keep it together. No, it's doing so many debuffs. It's It'll be okay. like it, it's debuffing with each of its attacks, so I feel like it's not really Thanks. worth it to to go for the for the buffs, even though they are the one, they are the one thing that can kind of keep lightning alive. Keep a cool head. Oh. I'm dropping an assassination here. Get a few debuffs at least going. Nothing else. Hope it's out. Beating on the hill. Hope. Hope's dead. I absolutely hate that they stack their raises. Like, if one character is casting raids, then the other one should just automatically cancel it instead of using up their ATB for it. Don't feed on lightning. No, no, no. No. It's a really annoying fight. Because... What can I do about that? Okay, let's... Let's switch gears. Let's try, um... Let's try, um, including... Try Matador. We will start off with Relentless Assault to take care of some of those. Raptors! <laughs> then we'll have Matador as, a, as an option to hopefully handle the boss. Let's 
a health break before going to the final final one. Kneels down. Quick heals for everybody. Don't kill like me. Okay, final raptors. Let's take care of them. As long as it doesn't feed on lightning yet. Alright, and then let's get rid of the small ones. That's not the small one. And it's feeding on lightning, so that's true. No. That is honestly one of the worst mechanics in the whole game. Now we're taking debuffs from everybody. Oh yeah. This is a disaster. Absolute disaster. So that's the end of the game. And so it ends. <sighs> Let's see what Odin can do. Odin. Lightning got slowed, which is not too great. Now I gotta wait for all of these. They should at least take care of the raptors, um, and then I can maybe hand over the flyer. Maybe.
<laughs> He's a bit of a villain to interact with the Lordia, practically dead. Until next time. Okay. This is worth debuffing. There we go. Time for another and lightning's out. Is it feeding a lightning? It is feeding a lightning. And so it ends. This game is just so bad at some of these things. sure what to do here. I mean, we could always bring snow in here, you know, to tank it up, but... But, but, but... See what we can do. Summon here and come on quickly. Oh no, why? Ah, uh, that scepter was wasted. And I got debuffed. I miss the fact that yep no good start gauge for that storm is here. that may have just failed the whole idea until next time nope seems like we still got rid of the frogs so that was the main point of it all Keep the enemy off balance Oh yeah, again, this is not going to work when I don't have control over positioning. Because it hits us with those... AOE attacks. Let's see what you got. Well, I guess we're just waiting for Hope to kill this thing. Mm. 
Relentless Assault again. See, the problem is when I go into Relentless Assault, it just brings Lightning to the same grouping with everyone else again. So, again, the tanking doesn't really, really work. Got this. Hello, Fufa. It's not a matter of getting it or not. Yep. It's a matter of the game just being bad. So, so many like. Terrible designs in this. I think we're just gonna ban this particular quest. Maybe come back to it at some point. The party, party leader dying leading to a KO is just. or, or game over. It's just like the stupidest thing. Fermugaming is now hosting the stream. Thank you for the host. Um, let's teleport over to something else then. Um, let's go... Go grab that uh, Cactuar. Even though that fight is going to have the same issue. But um, hopefully it'll be less bad. I think it was the one on top of the... I'm not sure, but I think it was the one on top of um, this thing here. That one. Since we already found the ribbon, we don't really need to dig, but hmm. it's money. This was the Cactuar. Nope, it's uh, the Goblin Ch Wait, hadn't I? Oh, I guess I haven't done this. Well, let's do this one. Uh, since it is in the Northern High Plains, so. So This one's going to be easy because it's just a goblin chieftain. Oops. Stay down. 
Oh yeah, with six six ATB gauges, uh, there's also a possibility for your room to come though. Just another battle. Mission complete. Survivalist catalog. That one uh, gets those um, uh, aerosols. Okay, so there's uh, there's one there. There's one there. I guess let's go here first. I guess the main problem with like the the like post game side of mission stuff is that because it's all like combat focused um it really highlights the worst part of the game which is the combat grab the chocobo Here's a Gigant tour. So let's see if we can beat this one. Hmm, actually now that I think of it, I wonder if you can dodge the 10,000 needles. I doubt it. But who knows? Who knows with this game what you can do? Um... Usually you just have to like eat it or negate it with some something else, but uh, you can't really dodge it per se. But again, who knows? I mean, apparently it didn't hit anyone, so I guess you can dodge it. There we go, hits hope. Oh, it's, it's using quite a lot there. Thanks. And it uh, completely shuts out the person it's used from. So that's not good. Quick. Oh, it's just gonna be using 10,000 needles Thank you. all the time. Okay, let's try um, bringing in Odin here. And see if I can do something. It's still hitting lightning with it though, so that's not good. Okay, so that doesn't really work. The summon. 
Like, we can deal plenty of damage shots, mitigating that 10,000 meters is another question. Um, but let's see if, um, if lightning can dodge it as, as a sentinel, because then that would be the key. I just need to get to the... Until next time. To the point where I can go into Sentinel and, and hold. Uh, does provoke well work? There we go. A loot on. Um, it does not seem like it would be, um, I also get put into pain, so that's not good. And so it ends. Let's try a sentinel... Sentinel medic... Sentinel Manic Ravager. Just as a as a proof of concept here. And see if this can be made to work. Because the start of the battle is basically one time when nope, okay. It was just we got lucky earlier when when I was able to cast a few more more attacks at the beginning here. So it seems to be fairly resistant to uh, provoke, which isn't exactly ideal. Yeah, so I can like elude it, but then it still comes in with the attack, and that still puts me into pain. I guess I could try to make lightning resistant to pain. Vanille's still a little bit slow on those heels, though. Vanille's not out putting enough healing. But I feel like if I... Um, if I get... Resistance from pain, that might work. Pain Dampener. Can I upgrade these? Oh yes, oh yes. Um, I don't have a save point here though. Doesn't <clears throat> I thought Ribbon um, comboed with? Oh, it's actually not in um, in a. Uh, synergy group. Huh. 
Um, we could also upgrade the ribbon itself. I guess it'll probably be worth it to go. Um, yeah, I mean, it's the save point is just down here, so I'll just go over that and I'll um, upgrade the pain dampener and the ribbon so we can uh, make lightning hopefully immune to pain. Then the sentinel can at least like keep that elude up, which I think is helping a little bit with the damage. Though I'm not actually sure if it's doing anything. Medigard would be better, but uh, Lightning doesn't have access to that, and I don't think we'll get it either. Um, yep, 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 yep. Uh, Reprieve would be very nice, but it's going to be quite costly to get to. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and do some upgrades. So, do I have, by the way, do I have any upgrade resources here? Um, not too many. Let me go shopping first. Let's buy some ultra compact reactors. How much would we need? We'll get a few. We're also going to need a dark matter. So let's start with the ribbon. This one's going to require um, 20,000. Okay, so it's going to be basically one. Yeah, one ultra compact without even upgrading it. Uh, the rest of these are pretty low. So I'll just use one. There we go. Boost that up. Get the ribbon upgraded to a supper, 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 super ribbon. And then uh, this one is the same same deal. So another one of those, and we have 30% resilience. Then uh, let's go for the pain dampener. So that's going to be 30%. Then pain dampener. Uh, um, this one's going to require how much exactly? Uh, 4,000. Okay, so. Let us not use the most, most biggest stuff on this. And that's going to be 3,000. There we go. Get the catalyst. And then it requires 12,000. So 11,000. Okay, the Ultra Compact is too much. Okay. <laughs> I have either way too much or, or not enough. Uh, let me buy one of those smaller ones. Let's sell the gold nugget. And I think I have some gold dust. Nope. And buy a few particle accelerators for the smaller jobs. Pain deflector. Yeah, that's still way too much, but at least a little upgrade to fill. Um, Alright, so that gives us... Should give us 90%. Huh? Oh, 
Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It it so so it improves the pain deflector itself to seventy two, and then it also gives um, status ailment resistance thirty. So that should be a hundred percent then, unless it's seventy two percent and plus thirty percent to that. We're gonna find out. Um, all right, so we got those going, and then. I guess that's that. I mean, wait a minute. I have a, I have a few upgrades. Let me let me uh, boost up Nirvana. Put some of those ultra compacts into this one then. If we can get the triple. Yep, there we go. Put those in, and we have 92 for this level now. Alright, let's try again. Again, I guess the problem is that the Neil now got hit by the by by um, fog, so we're not getting healing. There we go, provoke worked, and then let's loot. Thanks. Huh? I did still get hit by pain. So it's not a hundred percent. Also, the Neil's healing is still kind of lacking. Yeah. It's not going to work either. Let me bring in snow. I don't want to do it, but I will. Uh, let's bring in snow and let's do the same, same team up here. And uh, let me transfer the um, these as well. I guess they don't get kept at the top here. So pain deflector. Does no use evasion? I don't think so. Uh, super ribbon. I guess I can tag on one more pain uh, dampener. And then. I mean, resistance won't help.
Uh, the 20 sided die could maybe. Maybe be one. Let's give this this uh, setup a try. Christian's my name. Hello. What am I playing? Fun of the We're just doing some uh, post game content here, trying to beat up some of these. Some of these bosses. Get this provoke. It's really, really resistant to that, it seems. So does Entrench help me? It doesn't seem so. I would have maybe rather drop um, Medigar. I mean, Entrench does allow me to. Let's give it, let's give it a go. Although it, it it has a high chance of getting interrupted by these uh, needles, though, so. We gotta win this. It might get wasted. Yeah, and it doesn't do that much damage with this. Snow doesn't do that much damage. Thanks. Medigard, basically. Would be the way to go. Ah, come on. Keeps hitting me with pain now. Alright, this seems to work. We just needed to get the snow here to stand in place. Unfortunately, this is what a lot of these fights devolve into. There's somebody standing there provoking, provoking the enemy and the other, other one healing, healing them and one attacker. It's, it's lost its, um, challenge. Come back at me. There we go. And Medigard. This is basically what we could have also done to the other boss. Okay, we also need to clean up those, um... Those raptors. Those summons seem to do the job just fine. We gotta win this. I actually wonder if the physical immunity, um... would work for this, the perfect physical immunity.
has like a hidden um, synergy ability that I think we're strongly for like hope and fang. Alright, well, we're, we're, we're getting close to the end here. <laughs> this is extremely uh, press X to win because I'm barely doing anything here. Because these two just work automatically and now I'm controlling the one character who doesn't really do anything this. in this fight. again. Okay, two people out. Hope, finish it off. Thank you. Oh, it was about to get real bad. All right, all right. Mission complete. Cactua Doll. Um, all right. So we could go check that out. I hope that, uh, I can do it with... Oh, now it's gonna... Always requires me to redo the Paradigm decks. And this... Let me just see what Optimize gives. Eh, nothing good. Give me the speed stuff. Um, Aurora Scarf. Nimble toe boots. What else? Sprint shoes. There we go. Seven deadly streamers. Hello, hello. Welcome in. You're doing good. Um, let's jump off on this side. So I do not have to worry about those dogs anymore. Don't fight those big guys. Or do? We already beat one of them. Or actually, we have beat a few of them already. Um, chocobo. Give me a chocobo. Where's this one chocobo? This way. Chocobo! My life for a chocobo! Oh, 
Hello. Alright, so there's one more over here. Let's go check it out. If it's another nature, then it won't do it. We, uh, we are going to, we would have to do the one there. I think we must skip out on at least one of the super bosses because I'm not gonna be. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Hello. Don't scare my chocobo. Hello. This one we've seen like ages ago. Oh, it is another Zernitra. How about no? Uh, then we have a circle. Let me go to the teleporter and see if um, if there is any missions over in the massive. Tiny cactus jumping around. So the Archaeopolis. Let's see if the stones here have woken up or not. I feel like no, because I think these are the ones that activate like the final save mission. Nothing, but then again, they don't, they also don't show up as dormant stones. Let me go and check it out. I honestly don't remember. Oh, hello. You caught up to me. You're approaching me? thought so. Are going for 100% completion? No. Definitely not. Out of my way! 100% completion in this game um, requires you to collect and upgrade every item and that's quite quite the grind let him trophy from playstation yeah no 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 it was this way around yeah yeah okay okay yeah um all right well um let's actually maybe let's go and do the final titan battle 
think we might be able to might be able to do it. It's gonna be a bit of a long one, but we can probably manage it. Probably, maybe. I gave up on the last couple trophies. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's a lot of grinding. Which would be better if the game was better. In in their like combat mechanics. Hello. Don't. Don't attack me when I'm teleporting. I enjoyed 13-2 and Lightning Returns a lot better. Yeah, they, they are better with, uh, like they, mm, well, I don't know about Lightning Returns, but at least 13-2 is uh, better with the, like, gameplay. Alright, so we're gonna have to smash through some of these <clears throat> challenges to get to the final one, but, um, we could just go through an easy path. Avoid the Ochu and stuff like that. Shouldn't be long. And in fact, let me just put us into Relentless Assault for this. So we smash through them as fast as possible. Legend 2, it's one of my favorite current ones. Lighting Returns plays a little like uh, like 10 2 with the custom changes, yeah. Smash this one first. Basically, I'll just avoid the auction and then we can probably go whatever way. Otherwise. Oh yeah, this one actually does um, some uh, sabot sabotage does help in this one. Let's get in those debuffs. Vanille? Is Imperial the only one you can cast right now? Okay. Well, forget about that. There we go. How about you launch it? Oh, it's already dead. <laughs> no need for launches. Mission complete! I kind of feel like there should be a way to just skip the ones you've already done. Instead of having to do this whole, whole uh, thing like seven times at least. If this game gets a remaster, they're doing some quality of life improvements. 
Yep. But I mean, the problem is <clears throat> that, um, like, there's some, there's some just like big underlying problems with the with the combat mechanics which they couldn't just like polish up they'd have to actually change things and that wouldn't really work out like even the whole um part of me to dying ending up in a game over is something that you can't really change without changing things up a fair amount and I doubt that they would do anything like that because it would require basically them to implement a way to change party leader during battle. The gameplay was new and interesting at the time. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if it was interesting at the time. Oh wait, the other one's summoning. No, don't summon the Juggernaut. No, don't do it. Die, please die. Oh, you're not summoning the Juggernaut. Okay, well, still. It's just Mushusu. <clears throat> it's uh, simple enough to deal with. I don't think this. I don't think it matters which one. Oh yeah, because yeah, yeah. It shouldn't matter which one we take here because it's just gonna be. This is gonna be the final one. Thirteen two enjoyed on the idea, so it was at least enjoyable. Ooh, let's kill this bugbear. Um, that's the teleport I need to get to, so let's do this side. Hello, Borg Bears. No time for fighting. See ya. Okay. <gasps> We're fighting. Munchkin, Goblin, and Borg Bear walked into a barn. So, what are we going to want to have Paragon Lions? That's how it's done. There's no breaking, so. But then, on the other hand, that also means that we are probably want to drop in some armor at once. Wide open. But also have a tank. Maybe a few tanking um, paradigms. A few that just push. Push the stagger gauge off. Let us see. And 
then the final battle. So, let me set up, um... I think we can also use, um, Aegisol and Fortisol, so let me go buy a pack. One of each. And let's prep some paradigms. Might as well move them along those uh, Crystarians for as much as I can. Get a tiny bit more HP in here. Hope's about to break 3k on, on magic. I mean, Vanille's not too shabby either. And the others don't need to be worried about. Uh, but Paradigms, let's see now. So, um... We would want to have a, like, a Sentinel that is more defensive. Sentinel Synergist Medic. Um, then we'd want to have a uh, Sentinel Ravager Medic. Then we want to have... I don't remember if there's any bullying to be done. We are going to want to have um, Try Disaster here. And... I guess we could go with a... Um, Cerberus as well to get that uh, combo going with Try Disaster. Um, what else, what else? Oh, quick heals. Salvation and... I guess the Saboteur build. You disappear for a bit. Alright, thank you for hanging out though. Uh, let's see... I mean, we could do assassination as well as an option into jumping into Cerberus. So let me um, let me move these like that. Yeah, I think we'll actually start by going into assassination. I don't exactly remember if we can drop any debuffs or not, but hopefully we can. Um, alrighty, so let's drop some Age Soul, Forty Soul, and let's go. Shroud up. On your toes. On <laughs> one into Cerberus. to try disaster it doesn't seem like I'm be I'm able to do any sort of uh, debuffs but um, I didn't mean to go assassination but let me uh, let me see maybe maybe I just didn't get any hits I'll make one again and Cerberus And back to assassination. I mean, this isn't building up the uh, stagger gauge too much. Because um, Army of One really only improves it a lot when you're going into. when you're actually in um, stagger, so. I'm not pretty sure if this is worth it. 
try, uh, let's see how much it builds up in just like try disaster. It doesn't build that far, that much faster. Uh, I guess it does actually, I guess it does. Let's see about dropping a tsunami one in here then. Don't know. Um, let's do a quick heal. And back to try disaster. I should get some um, some commandos in here though. To slow the decay down. I'm sure we can drop a drop a in peril in here. Take that. Apparently no in peril, but um, yeah. slow, slow seems to work. There we go. Good luck. And try this S again. Oh wait, the deep protect uh, fell off. Deep protect and the shell on. There we go. Then let me uh, army of one into Cerberus so we can maintain the segregate a little bit better. Because I definitely don't want to lose that. New strategy. And back into try disaster. The key is to pushing that stagger gauge up quite a lot here in the early fight because later on Atticus is going to get stronger and stronger. So it would definitely be preferable to do it now. Before we get a hunker down on some, uh, some sentinels. Damage is ramping up already quite a bit. You asked for it. Here we go. <laughs> oh, there's the unrelenting blade. Building it up. Concentrate and hope. Okay, hope's gonna die. I think this is the time when I should be pulling out. Ah, oh, okay, that's not that bad. Not that bad at all. We're, we're losing the crowds now, though, so I think we'll hunker down for a little bit now with uh, protection here to get some buffs back up. the things um i don't really have i i think a little bit of a change could actually work better um gotta maintain that that gauge hope's real slow at bringing these buffs in Oh. 
lightning taking to concentrate and miss. Keep a cool head. I'll do a few of these so we can also uh, debuff at the same time. As Lightning's doing these cool moves. Oh no, Vanille's gonna get killed! Not really. I'd like to get the slow in there, though. Out of my way. There we go. Plus your protection before the meal dies. So concentrate seems to do like a triple. Um, a triple uh, dispel. Let's get the slow in there again. One hope. Oh, okay. The okay, that's that's hurting a lot more now. The blade. Let's really get that slow in there, okay? There we go. Slow is in in, in position. Curse. I don't really care about that so much. Little try disaster and then protection again. You're mine. And then we might, uh, we might be close to the point where I want to just um, have hope deal with the rest. Might be close. Heal this blade, okay. Yeah, no, not good. Not a good time. Let's do a big hit here, and then I'm worried I have to go into guard mode now. Meditates. Okay, let's go protection. Who's getting hits? When you're ready. Lightning? Oh, that wasn't so bad. When you're ready. Yeah, quick servers to maintain the gauge. To rush. When you're ready, new strategy. When you're ready, these camera angles <laughs> are kind of bad in this for some reason. Buffs in here. You asked for it. Oh, 
quickly, entourage, quickly, quickly, okay, okay, it's gonna break, it's gonna break, oh, no, 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 hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, quick, 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 oh, maintain that gauge, I do not want that to reset, guess we're gonna have a bad time, assassination. Let's get those debuffs in again. Okay, so it does... Okay, it, it does uh, quite a bit of damage if uh, you're not... you're not in a good shape. Let's heal up. And let's go to protection. Nope, gonna have to go into entourage real quick. When you're ready. And then protection. No, I think we just gotta gotta bring in after this meditation I'm gonna bring in uh Cerberus again. Not try disaster but Cerberus so we can maintain the gauge. Reapply the buffs, or debuffs rather. Army of one. Oh, needs to go into. Okay, okay, okay. He 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 oh no 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 no. Okay, lightning needs to be in in a sentinel mode for this. I'm right here. Thank you. This section is getting deadly. Thanks. New strategy. When you're ready. I don't think I can do the debuffs anymore. Or maybe. Thank you. No! I switched too early. I... Uh, I thought the meditation was already gone. I switched just a little bit too early. All that... Down the drain. We were going to win as well. <laughs> uh, I don't want to do that whole thing again. Uh... Ah, yeah. I think we're done for today. Maybe we'll come back to this at some point. Maybe not. But anyways, that's that's what you get with Final Fantasy 13. <laughs> uh, long battles and death. Um, thanks everyone for joining in on the stream, though. Um, that'll be that for Final Fantasy 13 for now. And um, next time we're back with Final Fantasy 7. Or not next time, because tomorrow we're going to be playing Oxygen Not Included. Uh, but next Final Fantasy stream is going to be Final Fantasy VII. So we're going to be doing New Threat mod uh, with a B route. So I'm interested to see see that, because I, I played just a little bit of it and it seems crazy. So we're going to see how that goes. Um, anyhow, we'll leave it at that. And uh, thanks everyone for joining, and I will see you tomorrow with Oxygen Not Included. <laughs>